apparently Queena can learn MP plus ten percent. Cool. Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play uh, Final Fantasy IX. Last time we picked up a whole bunch of stuff with Choco, made him all blue, and oh, didn't this time we're going to head into Bermisia, which is over here on the map. I walked there from Gizmaluk Grotto, which is there. Gizmaluk. I always say Grizmaluk. I don't know. Oh, if you look on the map, I guess I can show show this. Uh, you see the there little dot right there? That is Choco. <laughs> that is where he currently is. So uh, if you call him over here, the yellow dot will move, etc., etc., etc. Anyways, Bermisia. So this is Freya's home. What are you doing? Get over here. It's been five years. I've been away for so long. Not a night went by I didn't dream about home. I can't believe I'm here. I'm no longer the selfish child I was five years ago. The time has come to serve my kingdom as a Bermissian Dragon Knight once again. I'll do what I can to help. Me too! I help too! Let's go! Bermissia, realm of eternal rain! I didn't even bring an umbrella! What can I do for my kingdom? This is not the time. When is it the time? Okay, so first off, as you walk forward here on the other side of this crate, right here. Oh, thanks a lot, Freya. I come home, come to your home. I give you all the help I can, and you give me cancer. Thanks, Freya. <laughs> uh, that's another Stelazio for you. Uh, so I think that's it for this area. Let's just keep moving on. Fight. Oh! 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 Okay, I did not get it in the other file, but this guy gives you an, uh, is the, uh, teaches you a skill which you can, uh, learn with, uh, uh, by eating. It'll teach you the magic hammer, but I just killed it in two attacks because I didn't know how strong it was. Because I only found it in one other type of battle before, and in those battles it didn't stay for too long. <laughs> yeah, I never actually got a good grasp of how much it was because there was a... There's another monster in this place which summons those things. You'll, you'll, you'll see it eventually. Anyways, you just walk forward here and... Oh, look. It is them again! More persistent they are! Black Beaches! Kill! Where did I put my drink? I don't think it's in my room right now. I just bought a whole bunch of new computer components. I took them all to my room and I said, No, I need to record before I actually assemble this thing. So I am recording. And then after I'm done my recording my next two episodes, I am going to assemble my computer. And then all episodes after that are going to be recorded on the new computer. It's going to be awesome. Well, it's not... It's mostly a new computer. Why am I showing this fight? All oh, right, because it's mandatory. <laughs> oh, these things are exactly the same as before, and Vivi's gonna pwn them all. Boom! Go Vivi, go Vivi, go! Man eater. That should be on against those mages. I think that's. I think the mages are considered men. I guess they they got the form of it, so I don't know. The general will punish you for this! Yes, very scary very scary it is when the general gets mad. That's a weird statement to say. Um you can go into the room on the left, but I am going to leave that for now because there's gonna be another item you can get in there later on, but to get to that item you need to go here. There's a couple of items you can get in there right now, but I'm gonna go this way first to unlock the other item and it'll just cut out some walking time. Uh, if you go back here, you can find a soft. And if you go up here and talk to this thing, or just walk up to it, you don't even have to talk to it. Oh, 
water was still running in the sound. Weird. Anyways, this is a staple of the Final Fantasy series. It is known as a Mimic. It hides in treasure chests and will call out monsters in this game. That monster being the Magic Vice, dude. Yeah, the Magic Vice. Yeah, the Magic Vice. That's what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's see if I can eat this thing this time. Uh, let's have Zidane attack it, see how much damage it does. Damn it! Always kill the thing! 348 hit points. That's under that. So I think Freya is going to have to attack it. And apparently I just killed that thing in one hit. <laughs> I don't know if I'm overpowered or not, but that seemed entirely too easy. And Vivi just grew another level, so his magic's even more powerful now. Oh, it's good to be good. Oh, well. Uh, you don't get much of anything except for, like, the experience and such from them. So, yeah, just keep on moving. Uh, here, don't go through that door yet. That's the, that door leads on in the story. Now here, what you want to do is walk ever so slowly across here. And then you can get the Germanus boots. And then walk slowly across back. But this will always happen. If you run, if you attempt to run across that platform, it will fall on you. And you will not be able to get access to that treasure chest. You have to walk across. And you will lose it forever. I, uh, I don't know. Hold on. I don't know if the floor rebuilds. And if you come back on a later time. I don't think it does. I don't think you'd want to come back later anyway, because I think uh, I think that's like the third pair of Germanus boots I have now. Anyways, that was the one thing I wanted to do here. There's a... Uh, before entering this room. So there is a soft down there. There is a... Potion over there. And if you head on up, you can walk across now. Which is what I wanted to do. And over here... Oh my god, it's another one of them! Yes! Okay. And it's gonna call... Please be one of them? Cool, it is. And it's on the other side this time. Weird. Anyways, I'm going to have... Oh, right, this thing steals from you. Um. Okay, Freya's going to attack it. I'm gonna have Vivi use a magic on it as long as... I'm gonna use a fire magic on it as long as, it... as Freya doesn't do too much damage to it. Haha, <laughs> you missed! Freya, attack. Oh, right, I'm not backing out far enough. 252, I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to do a regular attack on it, and I'm going to have Queena try to eat it. Ah, Vivi! No! Vivi, you are too good! <laughs> oh, yeah, you can't eat the mimic at all. Oh, he actually used another call, so it's possible another one of them will show up. Unless I kill it. Yay, me! Bird killer! Level up! Although none of that will matter. None of that matters because this is where I stopped recording last time. Oh, crap. I didn't go into the room. No! Okay, I'm going to leave it here. And uh, right now, I'm going to cut away to the other file. So I have caught up... It was an entire two and a half episodes. It was well worth it. <laughs> okay, just a second. You know what's kind of funny? I, this, like, everything I just did in this episode so far took me the entire episode last time. Like, that was where the episode ended. <laughs> oh, like, right here. Anyways, um, back to my other file. I am actually, I think I'm a little higher in level uh, than I was in my other file, strangely enough. Uh, Zidane has all his equipment learn, basically. Um, I do not have the yellow choker thingamajigger. The yellow bandana thingamajigger icon blasted thing. I don't have that. But I do have everything else. Uh, they're basically just all a little bit further along. Um, and they're missing a couple of skills I had in the other one. Uh, little discrepancies. Anyways, moving on. In here, there is some sleeping people. And, uh, over here, go to the balcony, jump across, automatically, 
And voila, we are on the other side. And I believe there are some items you can pick up here. Treasure chest back there with an ether. Ether. Oh, and there's a dude sitting there. Okay, now all you have to do is talk to this guy. Get the bell by the bed and go to the palace. Protect the king, please. And if you go by the bed here... It said something, and I automatically grabbed it by pressing X repeatedly. It was a protection bell. Awesome. Actually, I think that's mandatory to do, so I think you actually have to do that. Now that I think about it. See? Anyways, now we get to move on here and find up back up to that top door. It's kind of funny that I had to play this game for a few hours just to get two and a half episodes recorded. <laughs> there were an important two and a half, and a half episodes. I mean, Choco had an entire thing. Yeah, I guess you need the protection bell right here. The bell in your hand and the doorbell are ringing! Imagine if all doorbells operated like that. That'd suck. That would suck out loud. Zidane. Vermissia's royal palace is beyond these steps. It must be in ruins just like everything else. I can't bear to see it like that. I understand, but we can't go back now. We have to find out who's behind this. I want to find out what those guys were. Who those guys were and why I look like them. Look, Vivi's scared too, but we all have to face reality. Come on, Freya, it'll be okay. Vivi, do you really know what you're doing? The answer you seek may forever change your life for the worse. Um, yeah, but, but I have to. I have to know who I'm about. Oh, I have to find out who I am. I'm scared. But what if I'm not even human? Vivi, what are you talking about? I'm not human, but you definitely human. Someone's coming. Who are you? Are you in league with the Black Mages? No. You're lying! There's a black mage right behind you! No, I didn't do anything! I would never hurt anyone! Lies! He's telling the truth! F Freya? It's good to see you, Dan. Damn, I haven't seen you in years! Where have you been? Actually, this isn't the best time to talk. We've got to get out of here fast! There are black mages swarming all over this place! What are you waiting for? Where is the king? I don't know. I didn't see him in the palace. Well, I'm going. I've got a w my own family to worry about. Freya, forget about the king and get out of here. We're no match for those black mages. I will protect my home and my king at any cost. Let's go to the palace. Yay. And we head up these stairs. And voila, we are at the second area of the game here. Um of the second area of the game. What the hell am I saying? Come on, dear. We have to go now. I can't move. Go on without me. No, I can't do that. Remember that promise we made in f with each other in front of Master Gizamaluk? How could I forget? But oh, my only wish is for you and our children, child to survive. Please bear a healthy child, darling. Raise him to be strong. Oh, Kai. It's too dangerous to stay here. You have to escape the Limblum. I'm sure Reg and Sid will protect you. But my husband, he was hurt by those black mages. He can't move. How can we possibly escape to Lindelum? Look out! Whew, that was a close one. Jeez, thanks. Thank you. Wait, Kai, are you alright? Yeah, we survived somehow. Can you give me a hand? Sure. Thanks again, pal. Maybe I'll see you again in Lindelum. By then, my kids will be born. You'll definitely have to come and see them. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Take care. And then you go back in, I think there's a treasure chest or an item you can grab or something. But I think that's going to be all for this episode. Uh, next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX, we are going to move on in the Palace of Bermissia here. See you guys then. Yay, I caught up!